We are joined by Eric Pooley. He is the Senior Vice President of Strategies and Communication with the Environmental Defense Fund. Thank you so much for joining us. Great to be here. Can you tell us about the opening ceremony and tell us why this is such an important event and who's speaking? Well, when you look at the caliber of the speakers that have been drawn to this event, you really see what a great convening it is and the kind of clout that NEHA has in the community because you've got HUD Secretary Julian Castro coming you know, former mayor of San Antonio and a man who as the, as the uh, Secretary of Housing and Urban Development uh, has an extraordinary clout. And that's just the beginning. Then you move on to an all-star panel that includes Pat Bricey from the Centers for Disease Control and Janet McCabe from the Environmental Protection Agency and Dr. Umar Shah from Harris County, uh, Texas. Um, and so it's an extraordinary assemblage of, of people. How this all fits together is uh, folks from uh, federal, state, uh, and philanthropic community. These are the uh, these are the people who are expert, dedicated, and they want to know what the federal government, state, and local governments are doing to empower them uh, to improve public health at the local level. So my goal as a moderator of, of these panels is to deliver that information. And if we're successful, they'll walk out of their plenary session today feeling that they have uh, you know, a couple of more arrows in their quiver. Now, as you mentioned, you are the moderator for this opening session panel, and, and you spoke about some of the topics there, but specifically, why is this panel so important in the healthy home sphere? Well, there's so much going on in the area of environmental health, and a lot of the focus these days is on, is on environmental health inside the built environment and inside the homes. I mean, just last week, we passed landmark legislation in Washington, the first um, reform of our broken toxic chemicals law in 40 years uh, and that's going directly to household chemicals uh, so I think there's going to be huge inter interest in talking about that. Uh, there are issues like lead that have been in the news, radon, uh, issues of climate change, uh, air pollution and environmental factors that drive uh, conditions like obesity and asthma. Uh, so it's a very broad set of issues that are of concern to the attendees at this conference. Um, and so the frame that we're putting over it is multi-sectoral cooperation, federal, state, and local working together to try to do something about a broad range of, of issues. All right, Eric Pooley with the Environmental Defense Fund, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you.